what is going on guys this is the final preliminary video to my for honor character guide this is the expert training guide man for those of you who are already insanely good at this game i'm talking light parry and pc players all of you guys man welcome 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 i've waited for this video i did all three of these videos in one day back to back to back so i really appreciate if you guys left a like on all three if you want hit that subscribe button and that bell button for future uploads and i'm just gonna waste no more time and get right into the expert training guide man so we're, what we're gonna do i'm gonna let you guys know right now i don't see myself as an expert in this game like i said in the intermediate video i I'm, i think i'm intermediate range but i'm also very well versed in this game i am a day one player beta player i played back when nobushi was the strongest character in the game because nobody knew how to play and so I'd, I'd like to think that I have expert tendencies, but I am not an expert per se. What we're going to do is you guys are experts, so you guys know the dealio. You have to pick fast, mix-up, intensive characters. That would be characters like Shaolin, um, uh, Gladiator, Aramusha. Those are characters you have to pick because you guys already know how to defend against the slower-moving, heavy-hitting, 50-50 guys that are Raider, uh, Warlord, uh warden black prior all those people so i'm gonna go ahead and jump in i'm gonna pick aramusha aramusha is one of the harder characters to defend against and without let's you first you want to click launch excuse me you want to click launch now if you're not an expert and you clicked on this video there is two other guides before this video both links will be down below in the description to each of those videos go and check them out before you get anywhere further in this video so since you guys are experts if you main any other characters besides the characters i'm about to tell you to pick it is okay to pick these characters this is only for defense you have if you're if you are an expert you have to pick an assassin character you have to pick a reflex guard character now before i picked gladiator because he had an even quicker reflex uh guard his guard went away quicker than everybody else's guard but recently they buffed him so you can pick really any reflex guard character i'm going to pick shaman the reason you want to pick a reflex guard character is because since the guard disappears quickly you can't just hold your guard to a direction and block you have to physically react to every single attack that is going to be shelled out from this bot so now that you picked your assassin character you want to jump into the bot match okay now that you guys have entered in remember this is an expert guide so again you want to copy these exact settings that i have down here player health off player stamina off opponent health regenerate opponent stamina off to do this you want to hold l1 or left bumper depending on which controller you are using and if you're on pc using keyboard and mouse it is depending on your keybinds uh but once you have that set up the way i have it set up you want to press start go to custom move set like always now depending you really only you don't really want any heavy light combos i would say pick if you want to pick one just pick one now for aramusha obviously his main moveset is based off of his light mix up so i'm going to pick these and you also want to pick guard break always you want to have at least those two and then you want to pick two to three unique attacks depending on which opponent you picked so i'm probably going to pick Oh, I can't pick an all guard character probably gonna pick a rushing wind and maybe this one as well instead of just tempest alternate both tempest and you also want to turn off move cooldown now again I want to let you guys know I'm intermediate I'm not an expert but this is the best way for you experts to practice pick some of the most unique attacks to the character you play against and you also want to refresh the character pick different opponents throughout the training session and just practice sitting here parrying them. That is all you want to do, man. Parry as much as you can. If you can defend against them, you will be so much better off when you play against these characters in online. And the fact that I picked our motion, I have a reflex guard character, I have to react. I can't just hold my guard in one direction. So it's big, it's a big up on my reaction. And I do this 
I do this. I don't want to say as much because I feel like I'm intermediate and I'm still not too good at that stuff. But I do like to practice against our emotions with assassin characters. Because they have the most mix-up. They can keep the chains going. You have to react to the attacks. And if you're an expert and you already and you're set in this part and you're good, again, you can only get you can only get so much practice out of move sets, okay? Custom move sets. Once you feel comfortable with the character you're playing against, as an expert. As an expert. Once you get comfortable, do enough blocking. What you want to do is press start. Go over to opponent settings. Change it to AI bot. Oh wow. I forgot. I thought you could change it from here. Change it to AI bot, but you want it to be level three. You want it to be level three. I don't know why I can't. I thought you could change it from this screen, but you want to, whenever you go to your selection to change your opponent, click on him and make him a level three bot. Now that he's a level three bot, this bot is one of the hardest. <laughs> they react to everything. So now that you're facing the AI level three bot, he's gonna mix up and throw his attacks out like normal. You wanna make sure you can react, defend against them. I don't know if you wanna try to beat them. It's really hard to beat a level three bot without ganking them. Cause they could they literally parry anything like watch. I just threw a light out, a random light, he parried it. There's a parry right there. Really hard to beat a level three bot in any situation. But once you once you have once you do feel good with defending against a character with an assassin guard, just defending against a level three bot, or a Musha, whatever opponent you wanna pick. Just practice defending against their attacks. Even try to get some parries off on them. It's a really, really good thing. Really good way to practice if you are an expert. Teaches you how to defend against their mix-ups. Again, there's no way to tell the difference between an online and a bot. So once you get comfortable enough with the level 3 bot, jump into a duel online for you experts out there. Other than that, man, it's been your boy Potion. This is the expert guide. You can do with it what you want. I have this is the, I have found this is the best way and the hardest way for me to train when out without going online. You can jump in here and do this. But next video you see will be a warden guide, a complete beginner intermediate expert guide on how to play with and then a complete in the same exact breath it will be the uh, how to play against the warden. So thank you guys so much for being your boy potion. If you're not already subbed, hit that subscriber button. And we will get into the character guys.